So what you see in this slide is an instruction format of 8086 microprocessor. You can see this is a 16-bit instruction format. Your assembly instructions will be converted into a machine instruction and that machine instruction format is the one which is shown here. You can see the first six bits. This first six bits are going to be an opcode bits. You can see this one zero 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 one zero. The various combinations of the six bits can give you different opcodes. Like you have move, add, all those are called as opcodes. The next bit to opcode is D bit and you can see what the D bit is telling you. If D is equal to 0, then you have the direction from the register that the data which you are getting it is coming from the register. Similarly, if the direction bit is to the register, then D bit will be 1. This you can better understand by using an example. Similarly, if the data which you are handling using this instruction is a byte, then this W will be 0. If it is a word that is 16 bit, then it is a, going to be 1. And you have this mode bits, two are mode bits and this is register bits and this is register memory bits. Now these mode bits and register bits and register bar memory bits can be seen from these tables. This is your register and these are all combinations for various registers. All these are various combinations for our various registers and you can see this mode bits and register memory, register bar memory bits. These are all the bits available for various types of addressing modes and various types of registers. You may not understand this until we solve one, one, one example. This is for 32 bit. So let us take an example for a instance. We will try to convert an instruction move ax comma bx into machine instruction. We convert one move ax comma bx one one instruction called as move ax comma bx into machine instruction. So. So first we know to need to know about this instruction. What this instruction does? This instruction will transfer the content of the BX register. It will transfer the content of the BX register to X register. So now it is now you can consider it in two ways. This instruction can be considered in two ways. One is you are transferring from register to register you are transferring to the register also the second case you can also consider transferring from the register you can have first case is transferring to the register second case is transferring from the register both can be considered so let us start with the instruction format let us come here 
let us take 8086 instruction format so first the move instruction let the move instruction be 1000010 and d direction d bit so d bit is let us consider now first case as direction to the register so when direction to the register this will become 1 this will become 1 and here you can see we are using ax bx register so that means you are we are using data word data word means this is once again 1 1 now let us see what is mode bit and register here you can see you are transferring to the register right you are transferring to the register so that two register combination bits you are supposed to put it here in this register so which is the register it is transferring so we have move instruction move ax comma bx which is the register it is transferring it is transferring to register ax so what is the that register that register will come here so what is the combination for uh, bit combination for ax which you can see here from the table which is given here this is the table you can see for ax register it is 0 0 0 0 you can see here this is 0 0 0 0 right 0 0 0 now what you do now you just put that here just put that here here comes your 0 0 0 0 now let us see what is mode bits and register so here you are actually transferring from a register so this is going to happen right so let us go to the mode register memory table that register memory table we need to have it with you this will be given in the examination see here now here it is a register right so this is the resistance it is a register your mode bit say this is the register we are using only registers since it this is all memory this is all memory you can see that square bracket its memory contains now because we are going to use the register here okay this is w is equal to 1 w is equal to 0 you see this is for byte this is for word now register which from which register data is coming from bx register and it is only register so mode bit will be 1 1 mode bit will be 1 1 and register that is bx register so bx will be correspondingly r by m will be bx this is 0 1 1 now mode is 1 1 register bar memory is 0 1 1 now let us put that 1 1 and 0 1 1 here okay so this will be this will be 1 this will be 1 1 and this will be 0 1 1 this we have taken as 0 0 0 this will be 1 this will be this will be 1 fine now what is the uh, machine instruction corresponding to this move ax comma bx now see you make you, all these are the machine instruction so how do you represent it in the hexadecimal format you take this 4 4 bits like this this is what this is 8 and this one 1011 1, 1. this is actually uh, 8 plus 2 11 11 is uh, B and this is 12 C and this is 3 8 B C 3 right 
this is uh, 8 plus 4 12 okay this is 8b c 3 